Hello guys, this is Zuma, and welcome back to Jackbox Party Pack 3. So, my voice is a little sore today, guys. So I thought we'd just chill out for a little bit and play Jackbox Party Pack. We're not going to be playing that. We're going to be starting off with... What do we normally do? Gespionage. Just to break us in, right? Let's do this. Hopefully I don't do too much talking, but welcome, guys. Oh, hope you've had a great weekend. So... Everyone watching in stream right now can play. I need to bring up my own web browser and let's have a look at the code. But there could be a group of people All right. In a room Full house. At this very moment, but I let's go. Everybody's in. This group of work associates or friends or family members would Three, presumably have nothing two, better to do right one. now than to circle around. Let's go. Here at the government, we are constantly watching everything. Like when you put an empty milk jug back into the fridge because throwing it away seemed like too much effort. It all gets stored in catalog for government use, but here we use it to play... Gespionage. Now let's administer some fun. First up... We collected data about... Search. Even this. Truth or dare, altered. What percentage of adults have played Truth or Dare after turning 30? Oh. Think carefully, you want to be as close as possible to the actual percentage to get the most points. Ooh. Okay, we have a 36. 36 percent. Everyone else, now it's your turn. Do you think the correct answer is higher or lower? You can also double down and guess much higher or much lower if you think the guess is off by 15% or more. Alright, so I don't think it should show you what people say right now, I don't think. Right. And people can see my answer here, so if you're winning, you can just copy the person who's closer to you, right? Running out of time. Slicky Vicky! Oh, she got in there. <laughs> now let's get to the right answer. 21%. Oddly enough, after retirement oh, what? age, the percentage goes up no to 89%. Way. Where do they get their stats from? That's what I want to know. So, who picked lower? Well done. You get points. Okay, who's up next? Everyone's had a true far dare, right? No matter what it, Well, it, definitely over 30. Okay, folks. Time to dust off your short game. Miniature golf? What the heck? What percentage of people have gotten holes in one in games of miniature golf? Miniature golf is that's not the same as I actually thought it was. I thought miniature golf and crazy golf were the same when I was younger. <laughs> I went to go and play miniature golf, and that is not crazy golf. That is literally miniature golf is so boring, I think. Ooh, hawk gone from All much right. higher. People are thinking it's lower. And Surveil says... What? Nice, Shiva. Right nice, Hawk. Points. Sorry, not sorry. A wee bit of lag on my end, sorry. <laughs> no worries. Slicky Vicky. Uh, wait. We can have we the... Ch what's job. going on here? Double there we go. Much higher. It's a bit Next better. Up. Typey, typey. Typey, typey. Come on, Gla. What percentage of people have functioning VCRs in their homes? Right, this is Jackbox 3, so I'm guessing they didn't ask someone like last week. This has got to be from 2014 or something. Functioning VCRs. Now that's another thing. Everyone probably has a VCR in the uh, the attic or something. That's quite a good guess, that glow. Is this going? What? When did was Jackbox three out? People are saying lower. Okay, right answer is forty-two. Okay. Not one person I know has a VCR in there. In their home, not one. 
Not one. Not one. If you're watching this back on Zoom or Upload, let me know if you think this is bullshit. <laughs> Most important meal of the day, folks. What percentage of people were allowed to have sugary cereals as children? Hmm. Come on, Maka. Sixty-seven percent. Higher or lower? Sixty. That's a good guess. That's a good guess. That's quite high. You're gonna get the strict parents, aren't you? That not allowed. I don't know. People are saying higher, and surveil says. Oh, well done. Not terrible. You get a few points at least. Let's see who got it right. Here's some points. Man, I'm like on two thousand. Okay, who's up next? Shriva. Oh, this is going to be good. What percentage of people have been interviewed on radio or TV? So now it depends where it is. I think probably a lot more people have been on TV in America, right? But radio as well. I don't know, man. All right. Hurry up. He's even. Most people said lower. Okay, let's see the right answer. 50%. Oh. Climbing in your window, snatching your people up. Hide your kids, hide your wife. <laughs> Greatest TV interview of all time. Half of all people. This has got, I don't know where they're getting their nice stats from, honestly. Like, I am so, I don't understand. I do not understand who they're asking. I don't know, how about? Fondue. What percentage of people love fondue? It's very, so fondue, we're talking about the uh, chocolate, right? With marshmallows on and fondue fountain. Is there only chocolate or can there be other? I've only ever seen a chocolate one. Oh, cheese. Melted cheese fondue. What the? I could get into that. Oh, man. Can't have too much, though. It's not really sickly. One lonely vote for lower. And the correct answer is... Oh, Hawk knows. Well done, Hawk. That was what you needed with the battle with Shiva. You got it actually quite close. Am I losing? Oh, no. Not quite. What should I search for in the old surveillance pro next? Worst game ever, Maka. It's okay. <laughs> What percentage of people cut their fingernails with scissors? Oh, man. Because you've got, obviously, you've got bite in them, and then you've got the actual nail clipper. Scissors. I don't know, man. It was a good guess, so it was hard that last one. And the correct answer is. <laughs> what the? F <laughs> I'd believe more people. I don't believe that. Three people? But they've all got V fucking CRs, though. I'll bet our database has some juicy data for this. Bunk beds. Oh, man. 
Vertical mattress mounting. What the? When faced with a bunk bed situation, what percentage of people prefer sleeping on the top bunk? It depends who's sleeping. Who's the other person that might be sleeping on the top bunk? <laughs> oh. Oh no, there we go. Anytime now, 61%. Everyone else, higher or lower? High five. All right. Believe it. Depends if someone wets the bed or not. <laughs> Ooh, split okay, across the board, right really. Oh! Less than 50%? This is not the America I knew. Some more people. America. So he just says that's not the America I know. I knew. So is it all American people? Is that why these are all really weird? <laughs> VCRs. Those America. Half of all Americans have VCRs in their house. It's time for the final round. We faked dozens of focus groups to determine the most popular answers to this question. If there could be one more U.S. president added to Mount Rushmore, whose head do most people think it should be? Let's take a look at the board. I mean, like, literally take off their head and... Well, it's Donald Trump, so this can't be that old. Popular answers to get points. Ready? Go! Oh, man. There we go. I'm always gonna wait to sleep on the top cause gas stinks. Yeah, but heat rises. Oh god, no way. Every game has to have a winner and our winner I don't is... think I came last. Between Shiva and Hawk, probably, right? Yeah. Oh, only 800. Well done, Shiva. Well done, Hawk. Wow, you played this game like 87% of people wish they could. And only 21% of them could ever Who came third? Where's the boys? Where's the boys? Any boy in third? <laughs> oh. Uh, you know what? We will... Oh, here we go. I've got him here. Glow! Glow was third. Man. And then I was fourth. Come on, boys. Nice. All girl top. Uh, so we'll go in new players. We're all here pretty much anyway, but I'll give someone else a chance to get in. Uh... New players. No, I was sent to spy on her. You son of a bitch, I'm in. Oh, look at this. Maka, me, when, altered. Is it a 4v4? Not that it's a girls v guys, it's just girls kicked ass last time, so <laughs> we need to represent. Who's up first? Foolish humans. Okay, computer. What do you have for this one? Lottery winners. So this is American lottery winners. What percentage of people said they would keep working at their jobs if they won nine hundred million dollars in a lottery? Shh. Liars. Liars. That's who. Oh man, this is a tough one. We have an answer. Twenty percent. Okay, everyone else. Time to guess if the actual percentage is higher or lower. You're going to have someone that works in a hospital or something like that, right? Who just does it just the... They're just really kind. The majority say lower. And Surveil says... Fuck off. I guess it takes a cool billion to settle down. 37 out of 100 enjoy it. That means 37 people out of 100 really love their jobs. Like, most people are unhappy. Don't give me that shit. Most people hate their job. 
Have I ever told you all my brother was killed by falling prices? It's all lies and not even square. A Walmart between midnight and 4 a.m. I don't know what Walmart. I've never been to Walmart. I've I've seen the memes on Twitter though, and it doesn't seem like it's a good time to go. It's like when when strange people come out. I don't want to say anything else. <laughs> That's gotta be quite high. It's gotta be quite high, right? It's just like, yeah, like, man, everyone's been to the to the store. Everyone's been to the store at 4 a.m., 2 a.m. Even for some late night, yeah, oh, I should have gone way. High. Why did I? Yeah, you what do you? Do they sell drink? Do they sell alcohol? If they sell alcohol, of course you're going to be going there at 2 a.m. If it's the only place. Ah, uh, see that one, I I can see why that one was so high. That's not so bad. They they sell weapons, Zuma. What the what the fuck? What percentage of people always wear green on St. Patrick's Day? Always. So does this mean never miss the single St. St. Paddy's Day? Sixty-six percent. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Hmm. I don't know, man. I've got a. Th oh, I've got a thousand. That's not so bad. Confide with a three thousand. They sell guns and knives. What? Like next to buying a fish or something like that? Let's see the right answer. Twenty-eight percent. I take it a bit further. I always wear green and I always eat salads. When? Good stuff, when? Got it right. Here's some points. 2,000. Good comeback. Okay, who's up next? Believe it. Vicky, you're up. I remember seeing good surveillance for this yesterday. Queuing. What percentage of people have stood in line for more than an hour to see a highly anticipated movie? Well, you normally book tickets, so why would you ever... I don't think I've ever queued up. Oh, this was maybe like 20 years ago when you had to queue up. Oh, oh, quick, 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 quick. Lock it in, lock it in. 40%. Oof. Okay, higher or lower. Uh... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go with the opposite to what I think. Because that seems to be the best way to go at the minute. <laughs> like, fuck. Most people said lower, and the correct answer is... Boom. That's what we call in the Good answer, Vicky. Good answer. Let's see who got it right. Well done. You get points. Hey, hey, hey. 3,000. I'm drawing top. Only count if the answer is off by 15% or more. Oh, when? Who's next? Oh. Right, buckle in. I've got one. Oh, this is where it gets. Guys, the stream's lagging. The stream's lagging. What percentage of people prefer to stay cool in their cars by means of open windows, not AC? What percentage of people prefer to stay cool in that? Nobody, nobody would prefer that. Twenty-four percent. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Yes, yeah, refresh, guys. Re refresh the stream. You got a bit of time. Who would want to open their window and not use their AC? John, I think okay, you can um, do the uh, as the audience. <gasps> oh! Oh! Points for you. Come on! Who got it right? Oh, let's go! I can't believe that. <laughs> yes, my people. Finally, I feel like we're connected now. Okay, who's up next? No way. 
I believe you know, I believe in believe life again. <laughs> what percentage of people pretty much always look at nutrition labels when food shopping? Oh, I'm a I'm a stickler for that. During COVID, I fucking ate everything. Didn't care, but <laughs> out of COVID, I'm looking at the carbs, man. I'm looking at the carbs. I think we're all generally health conscious, aren't we? So we've got to be a lot of people out there. Running out of time. Just one person says lower, and the correct answer is. Ooh. 21%. When shopping at McDonald's, it's 0.21%. <laughs> Confide. Oh, damn it. I was winning now. Confide just did that. I've got some points for you. Oh, how are we doing? How are we doing? I'm still ahead. <sighs> All right, surveillance pro. What do you have for this? Mattresses, didn't we? Have? Oh, no, it's the bunk bed one. What percentage of people have slept on water beds at least once? Oh, I've never slept on a water bed, but I've jumped on one before. Oh, God knows. Ooh, that's... Not bad, Macke. Lock it in quick, lock it in quick. 17%. Everyone else, higher or lower? Uh... I don't know, man. It, this is America, right? So, America probably have water beds. That's, I don't know. Water beds are really. I don't know anyone who's been in. Who has a water bed in England? Fuck you, game. Seventy-four percent. Fuck that. All right, we don't know each other now, game. Oh, no. Can you believe that? What percentage of people like their burgers cooked well done? Fifty-seven. <laughs> where are these, and Vicky? Where are these water beds coming? <laughs> where are these water beds coming from? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> who has all these water beds? Lies. That's who. <laughs> oh my god. What? So it's pretty rare. Where are all these water beds coming from? I've got some points for you. Like dropping out of the sky. <laughs> oh. By mining social media, we found the most popular answers to this question. In what language that they don't currently speak would most people like to be fluent? And here Ooh. are the most popular answers. Ooh. You get three guesses. ASL, what's that? The most popular answers to get the most what's points. ASL, age sex Good locate. Do you remember ASL? Do you ever use MSN back in there? Man. Hey, you are whoa, your boy's on seven thousand five hundred. Who's Oh, I should have I should have paid more attention. I should have paid more attention. I could win it or lose it right here. Alright, let's see what everyone picks. American. <laughs> Ooh, everyone's gone for French. Oh, I thought I was definitely there with the uh, Italian, no? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Oh, I don't know who. Now let's see those final scores. Come on, come on. <laughs> All boys, top three this time. Let's go. Surveillance, surveillance 
Where's all the waterbeds coming from? <laughs> oh. Alright, let's go and then we'll play Quip Quiplash next. Right, everybody's in. No, all of our field agents keep getting discovered. Sure, it's your tax dollars. Let's start another game of Gespionage. Let's start with you. High five. Oh, here's one we've been especially interested in. Don't ask why. Credit cards? Your first win. What percentage of people have all the information on at least one of their credit cards memorized? Well, including like the 12 digit number. We have an answer. 23%. Everyone ah. asks, do you think the correct answer is higher or lower? You can also double down and guess much higher or much lower if you think the guess is off by 15%. We know how to play it. I hear you. Most of you are saying higher. Okay, right answer is 32%. Lower number than it used to be. That's us. Yeah, right. Numbers in your ear while you sleep. That's got to be included, not just your expiry date and your issue number and sort right. code or whatever. Well done. You get points. You all know the 12 digit number on the front of your credit card? Or a third, if you do. <laughs> yeah, this is bullshit condiments. What percentage of people put ketchup on hot dogs? Come on, Shiva. Sixty-one percent. Everyone else, higher or lower? Hmm. Ketchup and mustard for me, please. And onions, lots of onions, fried onions. And surveil says. 67%. Ooh, nice. The other 33% maybe uses catsup. Let's see who got it right. Here's some points. Hey, Birdemus. Okay, who's up next? Oh, here we go. Ooh, I remember seeing good surveillance for this yesterday. Fast and the Furious. Oh, is it not? Diesel related. What percentage of people have seen seven or more Fast and Furious <sighs> movies? Nuss. All seven or more. It's like the saws in it. Who knows how many they've seen, really? Oh, there we go. 27%. If this is high, I've gone really, really high. If this is higher than this. I've never had a chili hot dog before, but I could get behind that. Unanimously higher. Okay, let's see the right answer. Oh, let's go. They're the reason why there will be a 30 second. Oh, I have faith in this bloody survey. I'm so far behind. Oh, 750. Why did you all go way high? I went way high as well. Why did you go higher than that? That's crazy. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe someone has seen like one or two, but all seven or more? No way. What percentage of women have worn toe rings? What if it is? I've never seen a toe ring before. <laughs> That's got to be uncomfy. I want to get caught in your sock or anything. 40%. Okay. Higher or lower. Have uh, This is I've ever worn toe rings, right? I don't know. High five. It's unanimous again. And the correct answer is... 59%! What? Men, it's a lot higher. No one? No it's way, when you wear sandals, Zuma. What about 
This has got to go for people who are in cold climates as well, though, right? What the? I hear you. <laughs> Damn hippies. <laughs> so I, I think me and Maki, yeah, we're both out, out of touch with the world, buddy, so don't worry. What percentage of people wink primarily with their left eyes? Left eyes? What the f... How many left eyes do you have? Left eyes? Am I reading that right? Okay, higher or lower. <laughs> this fucking game's brain fucking me. I don't like it. <laughs> I, wanna, I don't know. Is it your left eye? Yeah. Your right? No. Most people wink out of the right. Okay, right? Let's see the right answer. 38%. Hey, you're a better guesser than our Hey, well then, Shiva. Nice job. Got it right. Smart. Yes. Here's your points. <laughs> Just okay, close. Who's up next? Oh, your left eyes. Let's Someone see. started winking at me. Yeah, aliens started winking at me with both of their left eyes. This? Juice cleanses. What percentage of people have gone on juice cleanses? What does that even mean? They just like pureeing your food up or something. Thirty-five percent. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? I have gone for a period of just drinking like lemon water for a while. I don't know. The same people who wear the toe rings. <laughs> I just imagine loads of juice drinking, toe ring wearing hippies who are just all squinting with their left eyes, <laughs> like winking at everybody. <laughs> Let's see who got it right. What the Here's fuck? Some <laughs> what the hell? I don't... That that might make sense in a way. I'm no way in this. I don't think. Through totally legal means, we found the most popular answers to this question. Which superhero's insignia would most people wear on a t-shirt? Now let's see the answers. Oh. Huh. Uh, but only the top if this is... Answers will get you points. It depends which Ready? location they're asking. Whoa. This it depends on what gender and where they're asking, right? This could be okay, so far out there. I, I went for Captain America because I thought this they're probably asking a lot of Americans, so. Hey. Ooh. Hey, I went out on most people were Batman, I went out on a limb with that one. Hey, I could have got a few points here. I was nowhere, but. Oh, I'm still nowhere. Never mind. Shiva! Congratulations. You seem to know everyone's secrets. Remind me never to cross you. You hurt nobody said Green Lantern, but I think people are just trying to forget about that. 